All right. I have completed my giant shade structure, which will hopefully spawn uh, monsters. In fact, I think I already hear an Enderman. Now let's see if I can see where he is. Ha! An Enderman! Okay, so the nice thing about this is I should be able to stand relatively far away from the shade structure. Let's see, do I still have any stone left? Yes, I do. Okay, so I can even build myself a little shelter away from the shade structure. And then I'll just look at the Enderman, and he'll get all angry and come fight me, and I won't have to deal with any of the other mobs. Huh? Mm. Yeah. I'm building, I'm burning hawthorn saplings for the first time, and I got ah. an odor of purity. Hey, that's what you were looking for, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so the other man is still there. I didn't hear him for a while. I was afraid he had gone, but he's still there, so yay. Okay, Enderman. Are you still there? Oh no, he might be gone. Enderman. Boy, people have mined all over here. That looks like a pool of liquid poison down there. So does that. Oh, there are pools of liquid poison all over here. That could be problematic. Because, of course, Endermen don't like water at the best of times, much less pools of liquid poison. It's possible it's just what water looks like in this biome, but I think it's liquid poison. Uh, maybe if I cover them up a little bit. Do I have an empty bucket with me? I can check to see what it is. Yes, I do. Okay, let's see what it is, just out of curiosity. No, it's just water. Okay, well, that's not so bad. I mean, it's still not great for Endermen, but... Well, there's a creeper. Oh! I think I'm all right. Yeah. Well, there are some other monsters further away from me. Do I have any arrows? I have two arrows. Probably not worth getting out a bow. Ugh, I'm lagging. Lagging a lot. Probably because there's a lot of flowing water here. Not sure why there's so much flowing water here. Oh, whoa, wait a minute. It may be water, but it seems to actually be buffing me up. What have I got here? Night vision? Are you some sort of uh, springs? Uh, have you run into things called springs that do that? I have not. Yeah, uh, I was in a, a hot springs biome. Oh, that's right. All right, it's night. Time for lots of monsters to spawn, and there they are. And I am far away from my shelter because I wandered away looking for monsters. Well, now I have found them. Oh, well, I guess uh, that was... Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. Head for my shelter.
I actually could kind of use some night vision right about now. Oh, well. Okay, so we've got a zombie villager. He's looking straight at me, but <laughs> I'm not sure he's seen me. He just fell in a hole. He's heading this way, though. Oh, do I have a spare safari net? I really could use a zombie villager. Ah, oh, I think I'm going to warp homing and, and make myself a safari net. Because since uh, they say that auto spawners are uh, are banned, the only way to get more villagers is to cure zombie ones. Mm. And I'm probably going to be running into quite a few zombie ones while I'm waiting for enough endermen to spawn. So I should get myself some safari nets here so that I can uh, capture them and bring them home and cure them because I don't have the potions to I have to cure them yet. Safari net. And if, actually, I should probably get several. Oh, there's an Enderman outside. Oh, cool. Do I dare try to kill an Enderman? Um, it's probably. Are there any other monsters? Because they'll they'll be the ones that get you while you're fighting the Enderman. If the Enderman is the only one there, you probably could take it. Okay. String. Let's get 12 string. And let's get three leather. Well, there's two of them. And three balls of blue. Oh, you all right? The kitten yanked my mouse out of my hand by chewing on the cord while I was trying to kill an enderman. Oh no! Things are falling over? There's a cow up here with me. And I just turned into an Enderman. Woo! Yay! Don't touch any water until you turn back. <laughs> are they. Are those water bad for Endermen? Yes! I didn't know that. Yes. It causes them damage. Well, I don't know how the cow got out, but. Okay. I didn't get any drops, though. Oh, that's too bad. And I knocked your keyboard out of the floor. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, okay. I, I whacked the kitten when he pulled my mouse away, and he fell into a bunch of stuff. Mm. Good. Back. I hadn't loaded. So maybe the monsters hadn't loaded either. Oh, oh no, oh no. That's a regular zombie. Whoa, that was a creeper. This is not good. Not good at all. Oh god, where am I? Okay. That is a regular zombie. I will stand here and fight it. It is glitching all over the place. That is a regular zombie. Okay. All regular zombies too. There's another regular zombie. Okay. Yet another regular zombie.
Oh, and it's morning already. It's possible that my little safe hut here is actually too close to the dark area, and that's keeping monsters from spawning too near me. I didn't see very many spawning within my line of sight. So I'm going to move it. Okay, I am further away from the monster spawning area. And I think I'm also going to, since I have more stone yet, I'm going to close it off a little bit on this end to make it even darker. Aha! Now it is very dark here. Oh, looks like there's a little light seeping in over here yet, though. Okay. Aha! There we go. There's a very dark corner now. Hopefully all I have to do is leave it alone. And monsters will spawn there. Oh boy, I'm glad I... I'm also patching a lot of holes in the floor. This, this area has been pretty thoroughly mined out. And some of the holes have uh, light shining up through them, which is not helping. But also I don't want to fall in them if I am out here fighting stuff. I just got 18 saplings off of one hawthorn. Oh, wow. That's nice. It was a big tree. Somebody put a torch here. I don't want to break it. I'd be accused of griefing. So, <laughs> I'm covering it up. <laughs> hey! A monster! Only one monster, but even so, a monster! Not the monster I was looking for either. So this is, what is it that I'm getting here? It's regeneration, oh wow, that's nice. I'd be tempted to just stand in one of those pools. Okay, well, not a lot spawning there yet, so I'm going to go check out this nearby tree. Or bush, not sure what it is. It's just a tree, and it's inside by somebody's fence anyway. Buds over here kind of look like a, uh, not a smiley face, a, a, um, 
Not a frowny face either. The one in between. A straight face. <laughs> <laughs> like a meh face? Yeah. Stars are out. There was briefly a red glow on the horizon. That's weird. I wonder if the server's lagging. Because Twilight keeps coming back and then disappearing. Ooh, I now have a reek of misfortune. Oh. Okay, there's a zombie. It is just a normal zombie. Tell where I am from quite a far away, though, so I may have to fight all the zombies. We'll see here. There's another zombie. Uh, I think he fell down a hole, though. I have to admit, this is not spawning monsters as fast as I had hoped it would. <laughs> yep, there's a zombie stuck down in a hole with a hat on. And every once in a while he pops up, I see his hat. Oh my god! What? You alright? There's a tree running after me. Oh, so I guess there are ants. Uh, what tree were you cutting down at the time? Holy shit, this is terrifying. Uh, can you go inside your house and close the door? Oh my god, when he hits me, I go up in the air and then fall and it's terror- I'm on my roof now by accident! Oh my god! Well, maybe you're safe up there. Here comes a zombie with either a helmet or underpants on his head. That was really frightening. <laughs> so is that one of the things that can happen when you cut down magical trees then? I don't know. Were, were you cutting down a tree at the time? Yes. Okay. Which one was it? Uh, it was one of my magic trees. I think it was an alder. Okay. Here we have... Oh, it's a zombie. We have a zombie with golden armor. Zombies seem to be able to tell where you are from the furthest away. None of these creepers, as far as I can tell, can see me. The zombies always head straight for me. Still no villager zombies, though. Aha! I think there were finally enough zombies in the hole that some of them pushed the others out of the hole. <laughs> oh, now I've got a creeper heading towards me, too. It isn't that good. On the other hand, at least monsters are finally spawning. So the number of them spawning in my little dark area is not as big as I might have hoped. I wonder if more of them spawned under those islands because they were so high up, and that made it a very large volume of dark area, if you know what I mean. Maybe I need to... <laughs> Maybe I should have built my roof up in the sky. Oh. I suppose I could still go do that, but... Oh, gosh. I spent a lot of time building it already. Oh, my God. I finally got the hover screen over the end. Yes. And he has five by... Oh my god, oh my god, I'm turning into an ant. Oh, you killed him. Yeah. Oh my god, what the hell? Can 
you still fit through your door? Uh, yes. <laughs> I guess. Because I'm outside now. <laughs> this is ridiculous. So, uh, however wide the hearts bar for enemies maxes out to, yeah. which I think is maybe 12. He had five rows of those, and oh, that was wow. his health. <laughs> but I decided, once I got inside and could think for a second, I decided to um, to attack him with my axe rather than my sword. Oh, yeah, I bet. And that did more damage. Mm. If you could find a bucket of lava, you probably could also pour that on him. That might have set fire to some of your other stuff. Oh, no, lag. And there are monsters close to me. Uh, quick, break up the door. <laughs> Are you having lag problems? Yeah. Okay, let me know when I'm they're I'm mostly over. having kitten problems, though. Kitten. Oh, okay. Okay, good. I think we're... Oh, my God, I'm an end. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Stay away from fire. <laughs> Tiny zombie. Oh, it's a villager zombie. Okay, time for me to go capture him. Quick before the sun comes up and he burns to death. Where are you, villager zombie? There you are. Um. Oh no, where'd he go? Ah! Oh, okay. I got him. I think I got him. Yes, zombie. Yay! <sighs> so my villager at home will not be alone once I've cured this guy. Okay. Oh, there's a creeper. Okay. Any other monsters to mop up here? Oh, lots of monsters. There's a baby villager zombie. I'm oh, sorry, a baby zombie wearing uh, wearing gold armor. Not a villager, just a baby zombie wearing golden armor, tiny golden armor. A bunch of grass appeared. A bunch of grass appeared where? Uh, just around my area. Hmm. Uh, that might be like the Ent's special ability is to make grass appear. Yeah. And like occasionally a flower. Other stuff. Oh no, I'm in a hole. Ah, hole I didn't close up. And there's a creeper after me. Ah, whew. Gotta close up that hole. I thought there was another creeper though. I don't see him. Okay. There's still holes all over this place. Oh my god, I have a rowan sapling. Yay! That's the one you were missing, right? Yeah. And an ant twig. I wonder if to get a rowan sapling you have to kill an ant. I don't know. Can you plant the ant twig then? And grow uh... an ant? Or... I don't know. Okay, zombie with hat. Yeah, that's the end of you. Zombie with golden armor. That's the end of you. Oh, and I got gold boots from the zombie with the golden armor. And there's another creeper. Okay. There's a zombie over there. Oh, I need to uh, switch to a clean safari net here. Hello. There we go.
Let's see if I brought any wood with me. Because I've got all this zombie meat. I may as well be drying it for food. Bring any wood? Yes! Okay. And Twigs are used to make mutating sprigs and mystic branches. Oh, okay. But can you plant them to get more ants is the question. Or do you just have to hope that ants show up on a regular basis as you're cutting down magical trees? I don't know. And I have made myself two drying racks. Them I will hang rotten flesh. There we go. Hello, Toshi. Okay, a mystic branch seems to be something like a magic wand. Oh, interesting. Well, maybe if I close off the other edge too, I don't know. Hmm. Might be better off digging holes into the mountainside to make more dark areas for monsters to spawn in. So I guess I will do that today while I'm waiting for more monsters to spawn. It makes it a lot easier to breed my chickens when I'm this tall. <laughs> I seriously can think of no compelling reason to turn back into a person. <laughs> Just uh, be aware of Lava and fire. <laughs> oh, we got a uh, zombie wearing a hat that makes it look like he has a bone through his head. Or no, actually, it looks like he's got ram's horns, I guess. That's what those are supposed to be. Oh, hello. Um, oh, no! It's a villager zombie. I must capture him. Good. Two villager zombies. Well, at least I'm getting those. Emeralds are useful. Not as useful as under eyes, but you can make some pretty cool stuff out of emeralds as well. So I have to go two down in water in order to be submerged. Oh, that's nice. And apparently I have a two by two footprint because a single block hole is not big enough for me to go into. Oh. Hey, my rowan tree grew. Yay. You can chop down other trees without negative consequences? I don't know yet. <laughs> oh, well, that's nice. I believe I've now connected my area to uh, a honeycomb of mine shafts. So that means there's now a larger area, and hopefully things will be more likely to spawn. Fingers crossed. Well, 13 saplings from one tree, that's nice. Okay, I have been closed on yet one other side. Oh, here's a zombie. 
Oh, an Enderman! Okay, Enderman. I am coming for you. Oh, there's a skeleton in the way. There you are, there he is. I see where he teleported to. Oh no, there. Oh, I killed him, yay. And now I'm an Enderman and I'm taking damage. Oh no.